live on what's known as the bleeding edge of technology. I'm a real trendsetter, real thought leader, if you will. Case in point, the Google Pixel XL, a phone that came out in October 2016. This made its way into my hot little hands no later than June 2017, so. Actually, in my defense, it was really hard to get one of these, but we are splitting hairs. Let's look at some tricks. Okay, some of these tricks are pixel specific, while some come with the latest version of Android. So to use a very modern day phrase, because I'm so bleeding edge, don't tase me, bro. <laughs> don't tase me, bro, please. Okay, the phone's off, right? You can double tap it to see your notifications, um, or if you wanna check the time, that's an easy one. You wanna use the camera, double tap the home button real quick. Straight into the camera, boom. Then on your home screen, depending on the app, you can hold down on it and it'll give you a list of little quick things you can do, like Outlook, I can create a new event or a new email, Google Play Music, I can, whatever. Then if you move it around, you can do stuff like remove it or move it to a different screen. Then we can double tap this square right here. This'll launch the last app we were in. So you'll recall we were just in camera, so double tap, boop, goes right back into the camera. Also, let's say we're in a program, we wanna get into it, we wanna do a split screen with a second program. We can hold down this square button and then pick our other program and we can adjust the size of each window like so if we like. Another cool feature if we go into the settings menu and then moves, I wanna make sure that swipe for notifications is turned on. What you can do is your little fingerprint reader on the back here Stroke it down like this, stroke it once, stroke it twice. That'll show you your notifications first, and then your systems menu second. There are a bunch of other cool things in this move menu. Um, you'll notice that double tap thing I showed you at first, I think that's on by default. Lift to check phone, that may be on by default, I'm not sure. Back in settings, again, under display, uh, night light, this is a great mode. This turns on at, I have it to automatically turn on at sunset. Um, so sunset to sunrise, you get this kind of orangey hue, which makes it really easy to read, especially in bed when the lights are off. Um, it looks, it's kind of weird at first, but I actually really like it. So if you have, uh, if you deal with eye strain, this is a good setting. And also in settings and notifications, you can pull down this little sub menu here and pulse notification light. Watch what happens when you get a notification. Get this little tiny light here that'll kind of pulse, if you will, when you've got a notification waiting for you. And if you really want to have some fun, maybe all you want to do is have some fun, a la Cheryl Crow, hold down this settings cog for a while and watch what happens. It says, congrats, system UI tuner has been added to settings. So down here, System UI Tuner, you can do a whole bunch of stuff. Be careful, because it's kind of experimental features, so you're gonna have to agree to that. And then you got a whole bunch of stuff you can do in here. And then, one of my favorite features, since this thing has a honking battery, this little doodad that came with the phone, you can use this to charge other little devices. So we'll charge a second cell phone here. Just plug this into the bottom, and then plug this in. This is just a standard USB charging cable for this phone. And it's supplying it power. Yeah, it's hard living as far into the future as I do. Like, do I like watching TV in 720p? Of course. <laughs> and I can afford to do so. Do I have a PlayStation 3? Yeah, I do. I do. And does my car have an automatic transmission? It does, of course. Because here's the edge. Here's where it's bleeding a little bit. Here's me a little bit above it. Right, just skating on the bleeding edge, just like that. Hydroplaning, if you will, on the bleeding edge, just a little bit above it. Just coasting along.